Hello everybody, you are on Andrew Hello channel and today I'm going to show you how to clone your SSD or HDD. I want to clone all the information from my M2 drive to this SSD. How to do it correctly without any issues, I will show you right now. All the process are very simple, just repeat after me. So for the beginning, we need to connect the second hard drive to our laptop or computer. If your laptop have two slots, one slot to install M2 drive and one slot to install SATA drive, you can install both of these hard drives and then just run your laptop. But if you don't have two slots, actually my laptop have, but they are in the same place, I could install only one hard drive so I could connect this SSD to my laptop by using this special adapter. I will use it to connect this SSD to my laptop. So all the process is very simple. You just need to connect here and insert this thing to your USB. So fellas, how you can see, I have already installed Windows 10 Pro. And now I need to clone all the information on my second hard drive. I already connected to my laptop by using special adapter, SATA adapter. Now we need to copy this link. All the link will be in the description. Open your Chrome browser. In my case, it's Chrome browser. Insert the link, press enter. And we need to download this special program. Click here download this program after it download we go to our downloads extract all the files and install this program this is mini tool partition wizard program and this program will help to clone all the information to our second hard drive pay attention to the version of the program Right now we need to install it, click next, next, install, wait until installation process will end and launch the program. If you have already installed some other operating system on your second hard drive, don't worry about that because by using this program we can delete all information and all partitions. So right now we just need to launch it, click finish and the program will run. We can close this website, click here. Right now you can see this is my hard drive on which we already have installed our operating system. And this is the hard drive on which I want to install this operating system with all files. Actually, we want to clone all the information from this hard drive to this hard drive. Right now, we need to delete all the information and all partition of the second hard drive. For this, we need to click here, delete all partitions. Click here. Are you sure that you want to delete all partition on disk 2? Yes. It's so easy, we already delete all information and all partition that was previously on disk 2. And now we need to copy all the information from the first disk to this hard drive. For this, we need to click here, migrate OS to SSD or HDD. Here we need to select the first option. I would like to replace my system disk with another hard drive. Click next. This is a very important window. We need to copy all the information from disk 1 to disk 2 because our operating system and all the program and file install on the first hard drive. So we need to select the hard drive on which we want to install all the information. Select disk 2 and click next. Here we don't need to change anything. Just click next. Finish. So guys, we already prepare all important information and options to copy all information to the second hard drive. 
and the most important thing that we need to do right now is click apply click apply we strongly recommend to close all other application before you apply the pending changes just click yes and the process begin you may see this window operation copy partition cannot be complete because drive c is being used now please choose one of following option restart your pc and mini tool partition wizard will automatically finish rest of the pending jobs we need to restart our laptop or computer so be sure to close all the windows and the program before you click restart now and then we prestige to the next stage of cloning our hard drive so after you restart the laptop you will see this window that's mean the installation process begin you just need to wait until it install and copy all the information on the second hard drive then laptop will just restart and it will save all the information and the other files. So let's get it started. As I said previously, on my laptop Dell E5470 are only one slot SSD M2 and one slot SATA, but you can use only one drive in the laptop. So right now I need to disassemble Dell E5470 laptop because on this laptop already install SATA 2.5 form factor SSD and I need this cable just to connect my second hard drive to Dell E5470 laptop. All the process are very simple, I just need to unscrew all the bolts and remove the back cover of the laptop. Actually you can see the cable that will help me to connect my second hard drive to Dell E5470 laptop. I will remove M2 drive and connect the second hard drive SSD SATA 2.5 form factor and turn on the laptop. So let's see what the result we get right now. So guys, I already turned on the laptop and how you see it really cloned my operating system. How you can see, all the process are very simple, all the program and all application are installed, so we do not need to reinstall any program and any application. If this video was useful for you, please like it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, it will help me a lot. Also, on my channel you can watch a lot of interesting video. I will be glad if you watch all of them. Goodbye everyone, see you soon.